This is Technopop7 and today I will show how you can bypass parental controls on this device. So to start you will need to uh, launch settings. So let me do that myself. Then enter the Google category over here. Onwards go for the manager Google account. Then tap at the get started button, open data and privacy section of the settings, scroll it all the way down and initialize the delete your Google account function. Then in order to continue, we will need to verify that it's us by entering the account password. So let me quickly do that off camera. And then just finish the account deletion by checking those two boxes at the bottom, tapping at the delete account, and at this point, the parental controls should have already been deactivated. Uh, let me see. Uh, sometimes for uh, some phones, take a good minute or two to acknowledge those changes, to synchronize everything properly, especially those if we are talking about the low performance smartphone like this one. So let me see if any changes were actually recognized by the system. Yep. So as you can see, there is no longer Google account here. And let's see if there are and no parental controls as well. So great success. Everything syn was synchronized properly. Now, uh, once the parental controls has been successfully gotten rid of, I will quickly show how you can recover your Google account so it will not be lost forever. You will not lose it in it and well, it will not vanish. So in order to do that, you will need to simply sign into Google app with it. Any Google app will do. Should it be Play Store, I don't know, Google Chrome, what apps do we have? Google Drive, Google Photos, whatever. So I usually just go with Play Store. So you can also select or choose the Play Store for this particular task. So start by inputting the email address Then you should see the following message. After this message appears, enter your Google account password as well. Nine out of 10 times you will see the something went wrong error. That is completely normal uh, and well, happens more often than it doesn't. So just uh, re-input your credentials and the second time through, it usually allows you to proceed with the login. Well, not usually, it always allows you to go onwards, which is absolutely true in my case. So I will quickly finish the sign-in and well, by the sign-in alone, by the fact that we can log into the app with the account, you can already tell that it has been successfully restored and you can start or continue using it as normal. The parental controls didn't get back, no worries. But well, as far as this video goes, that will be it. So thanks for watching and bye bye.